Hello, ladies and gentlemen, it's I, Bramlin, back again with Critical Failure. And I know it's kind of late for a video. It's, uh, these past couple days have not been very good on my end, uh, mentally. Uh, just a lot been going on. Ed's been here and I've been driving a lot, so not a lot of good things have happened in terms of being able to scheduling. So I'm going to start waking up really early just to get videos done here, starting a schedule. That way I can get videos out. Uh, I tried doing the one in the morning, one time in the day, and that kind of fucked up. And this is something that I'm trying to do as a serious thing, so that's going to happen. Uh, I'm going to talk to Ed about trying to record the set into Avernus. We are going to be doing that just me, uh, Wesley, Prescott, and him, uh, Ed, DMing. I'm currently running through Curse of Strahd, but there's so many new players and stuff happening that it would be a poor representation as a media, as a DM. Uh, we're currently running through Death House, but I will be doing like basic like nods towards it here and there, just talking about the campaign every once in a while. Uh, but yeah, this video is on the Encounters for the Crypt Spider. It's it's weird. Ed and I spent like three hours coming up with like four sentences worth of stuff last night. Not because we were drunk, but because the Crypt Spider as is is just very kind of tightly compacted in terms of its own lore and the fact that we don't believe that this is going to be really outside of its own thing we had found it really hard for it to uh really not be used as any normal dm would so uh i'm just going to give it straight forward this is going to be a short video and uh don't be mad at me so the water and air are, are kind of put into one we don't really see crypt spiders uh being out and about in any way shape or form unless they're in like a forest or their natural cave layer or at least that's what i'm thinking is they'd be in a cave layer so unless you're being hunted down contained or being used as an intelligent ally for a transportation type of video to poison someone or to be used for a poison supply we don't really think that they'd be on an airship or a ship in general so do with that as you may on the land it would be basically while engaging it, uh, it'd mostly be in the layer of the Crypt Spider. Uh, it already have pre-made traps, webs, and all that type of stuff. And the area will be considered difficult terrain as the Crypt Spider will utilize the stickiness of the web and uh, it can shoot out to disable foes coming towards it. Uh, we decided that the Crypt Spider can be used as a mount by smaller, smaller, smaller creatures much as the Dero can the Steeders, and it has a frightful presence ability where the uh, a tingling fear sensation takes over all within 15 feet of the Crypt Spider, and a safe DC is a 15 uh, charisma saving throw, and all those who pass will be immune to that Crypt Spider's frightful presence, but not others around it. This thing is probably going to be attacking in mobs, not just one or two, or imagine like five or six. This is going to be within the home territory of a Crypt Spider, so... We're not really seeing these things not winning the fight. And if you use these with Arbeosh, which we were talking about in uh, the actual Crypt Spider video, you're probably going to be ganged up on and absolutely poisoned to death by it. We didn't give it any extra attacks as it had a good bit on itself. And it's just disruptive as a creature on its own. So yeah, uh, yeah, that is the video. Thank you guys for watching. I know it's a very short video, but it's kind of sweet and to the point. Thank you guys for watching. Leave a like and subscribe. And we're probably going to be doing a vid one video a day for a while until I, I'm probably going to start it, what is today, Thursday? Probably Monday, doing it all in the morning and then releasing it throughout the day instead. So that's probably what's going to happen is I record in the mornings and then release it according to how my schedule was supposed to be, one in the morning, one in the night. So that's what I'm going to do. So thank you guys for watching. Please leave a like and subscribe. Please comment down below what you have. Anything to add to this? or possibly, you know, suggest a video for us or anything. And uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching. See you guys in the next video.